So if you've been a fan of my channel for probably, I want to say the last four or five months, you know that I have an undying love for Paper Mario. And as soon as this game came out, I was so there. So today we are playing Paper Mario Color Splash. And I'm sorry that um, the way they designed this game, a lot of it has to do on the gamepad itself. And... Um, during it's mostly during the combat sequence. Oh, now we're talking. Looks like there's something on top of that box. I know I could jump up there. Um, most of it's during the combat sequences where I pressed A to check, not A to jump. Thank you. Yeah. Um. It's. I'll I'll do my best to edit, to make it seem more flawless so you can see what kind of card I'm going to pick before I battle, but if it's not a big deal when I'm in editing, it doesn't seem like it's that much, I, I'll just leave it out, because um, as soon as it gives you a stupid tutorial, and that's, it's just one of the things where I wish they just go back to the original formula for, um, for Paper Mario, the uh, RPG style, it's, I just don't know, it, it kind of bums me out that they keep trying all these new things. I know they're going off of the um, Sticker Stars, which is the 3DS um, Paper Mario. They're going kind of off that where you have to pick your sticker and then the sticker in turn d does an attack. However, I miss the old da -da 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 -da, and then you start fighting and I I, I don't know. That's I guess it's just a personal preference of mine. So what can what 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 can be done? Um, let me think. I've never been here before. So a little bit of backstory. Princess Peach um, just received a piece of mail, which is to the left of her. If you look at it, look right there, it was a folded up tone toad. Sorry, which is just blank. It's and that's what it is. And um. Someone's been stealing colors from things. That's why there's so many blotchy spots everywhere. From the um, Prisma Isles. I believe that's what it's called. Prisma Isles, not Prisma Islanders. Whatever. It, it kind of remember reminds me of... Um... Oh, there we go. It reminds me of... Um... Oh, what is it? Um... The Mario game with the Dolphino Isles. Um... Super Mario Sunshine? Sunshine? Yeah. Super Mario Sunshine. And I have played a little bit of this. I haven't gone too far. Because I wanted to record it. I just got in here to get a feel for everything. So I know where most of the things are. And how I was even going to attempt to record the uh, gamepad. Which apparently you can buy a capture card for it. But you have to send in your um, gamepad to whoever you buy the capture card for so they can install software on it um, and it costs around $300 which is stupid I'm sorry I much rather you know get a camera and mount it onto my gamepad but that's still iffy because then there's a lot of editing and there's a lot of mistakes that can be made doing that and I think it just frustrate me so we're just gonna have to do okay a specialized tool to open this pit can well, the only tool we have a bit more blunt, maybe it's worth looking to take in a swing. Whack! Yeah. Huey. Because they love puns. That's another reason I love this game, is because they because they like puns. I love puns. I wish I was better at puns. I love them. Uh, we're so sorry. Uh, stop being mad at us. A paint can? You think I'm just some regular paint can? Alright. You don't look like you're from around here, so... I'll forgive that comment, but I am so much more than a regular paint can. Anyway, now that I'm awake, you're gonna grab a burger or something. Your treat? We're gonna grab a burger. Oh, um, we're actually here to investigate a strange letter we received that from your town. Only, that's not an, an ordinary letter. It's a toad, drained of color and postmarked from Port Prisma. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Princess Peach from the Mushroom Kingdom. Sorry, I am not good at voices, so you gotta deal with my voice. And this is my mm, friend, Mario. He jumps on things, hits them with a hammer, when necessary. And 
I also have a very bright and hardworking retainer around here somewhere. Yeah, Toad kind of ran off. Oh, I'm assuming he's in trouble. I know he's in trouble. Huey is on the case, apparently. Okay, let's roll. We're coming, Toad! Stop it! My my beautiful colors. Goodness, what's happening? What are they doing to him? That's what uh, what happened. Mario, help me! I I can't feel my pants. I can't feel my pants. Actually, no. Uh, my parents got my pants for Christmas. Oh, look at him. yeah. These are the cards, and uh, when we're battling, I'll try to get it on the screen. Um, I'll show you what it what it's like when it's when you're playing. But and Toad is no mass. No mas. No mas, Senor Toad. Toad! No! Okay. Okay, here he comes. Alright. Wait, pause. That's what I thought. I have no paint. See, you need paint. I don't care. Uh, you need paint in order to fill up the card. And Huey says he can smell... Um, paint from a mile away, yet there's no paint. However, if I wha went up and whack trees or whack a flower, you can get paint off of it. But, I guess now we're going to squeeze Huey, which you do have to do multiple times in um, the game. And it turns 3D objects into like 2D. Woo! I'm so light and airy. Is this what you paper folk feel like all the time? Yeah, but see, we have backsides. Alright, enough flipping in the wind. Just paint so uh, you, uh, just, uh, just paint you absorbed as basically my blood, sweat, and tears. You'll have time to shower later. Okay. Uh, use the paint to power up those battle cards your friend gave you. And those battle cards are plaster, or... And then use the battle cards to plaster these introverted assassins. My god, I can't read today. I don't know why. Hey, so you're just going to go ahead and attack you now. I mean, is that cool? No, it is definitely not cool. And since we are there... Uh, since when are there three of you? Whatever. We've got cards. We've got paint. You know what to do, Mario. I sure hope so. Okay, what are we doing? Okay, so this this I'm just gonna kind of skip through this. So on the gamepad when you're playing it, oh well, he's on my gamepad right now. See, uh, it's not gonna focus. Nope, not gonna focus. Well, that sucks because I really want that. You kind of see it. It doesn't matter. Um, he's basically just telling me how to do the whole battling system and uh, how if there's multiple on one card, then it will. Basically, you can do it multiple times, and the bigger, the stronger, and you put it up in a certain place and paint it. So the way I'm going to do this, I'm going to do this, ready the card. I know, I'm so sorry you can't see any of this. It's not really, like, neat or anything. Oh my god, can you be just right up? Okay, I'm painting the card. We've finished the painting. And, and I didn't notice that. I guess because your attention is always on the gamepad, but you'll be able to see it better than I can. They're bad talking me. <laughs> Don't worry, everyone else bad is first. Ooh. Okay, so we're gonna finish the painting, flick the card into play. Once he tells me to flick my card into play, that is. And then it pops up in the top of right, just like that. So you will see the card that I am using. So I guess it's not all that bad. Okay, we're gonna do the jump attacks. And one. Oh, whoops. I'm usually really good at these time things. Probably growing up playing the playing the game. All right, we might as well do part of the master attack is attack you, and then you just press A when they get close. That way you can block. I'm always. There you go. There we go. No, no, no harm, no foul. Okay, and then you f go through here, find a card. And rinse and repeat, basically. However, now now it's just much faster, because I know what all the cards do. All the cards that I've found so far in the game, I know what they do. 
perfect. Yeah. You also get a bonus if um, they don't attack you. That's why I like to keep multi-bounces on me at all times. That way you can just uh, take them all out. Okay. Man, I'm starving. How about that burger? Uh, Huey, we have more important things to talk to do right now. I'm sorry. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to wait on that burger. Okay. Revive him with paint. He he would come back as a kind of freaky zo zo zombie toad. Zod, the zodes, zombie toad. Battle cards. Uh, just imagine how creepy that would be if they all came back as, like, toad zombies. It sounded like my rabbit got out again. My god, do you know how many times he gets out? <sighs> He's a pain in the tuckus, I'll tell you what. He's better than what he used to be. He used to fight and get himself in so much trouble. I've spent too much money on him in vet bills. Back to the game. Uh, so this can be saved and we'll pay. Uh, da, 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 bendy straw. Yeah, the other freaks with the bendy straws. Okay. Yeah. Can we just skip this, please? Six paint stars, which we're eventually gonna all have to find. It's kind of like um, oh, what do you want to call it? The stars from the other games. Other six from then you fight Bowser. Okay. Man, I really wish, because, so, I think it's kind of backwards, because they make it so you can do it all on the gamepad, that way it's an off-screen mode, which I absolutely love. I spend more time with this on off-screen mode than I do on-screen, because I like to watch TV when I play video games, because I can't play video games without background noise, which is really weird. Uh, just a poor color soul over here. Oh, I'm sorry, Princess Peach. I'm so sorry. I didn't... I, I, I was kind of just mashing A. Um, but yeah, I, I can't really play games without background noises. That's why I like doing this, is because I can hear myself talk and I can make up things. If I sat in a room, not doing something, just talking to myself, and someone walked in, I think I'd be embarrassed. I think I would. Now if someone came into my room and saw me doing this, they'll open the door and go, hey! And then just walk right back out. Okay. So, hey Mario, nice work at those battle cards. I gotta say, your action commands are looking a little sketchy. If you ever want to practice, just stop in my uh, dojo or house. Then hang out, watch movies, whatever. I got surround sand. It won't be weird. It'd be pretty weird. Okay, is there anything down here? I keep forgetting. No. Doesn't look like I don't know what that blocks for. I'm sure it comes in handy later on. But this is kind of like the hub, so this is the, like, main place, you know? Okay, I'm pretty sure he's the ugly... <laughs> he's ugly crying. Oh no, not ugly crying. Never go full ugly cry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry if people ugly cry, but oh no. No, no, no. Okay, he's so basically he's upset because of the um, <clears throat> because the paint star is gone, all six of them, and there's one giant paint star. Isn't it gorgeous? Mm, depends on your depends on what you think gorgeous is. There, gorgeous. Um, okay, he's right. We definitely owe him a favor. We owe him a flavor. Uh, okay, what do we do, Mario? Can we help Mr. Can? Yeah, of course we can. Mr. Can is my father. You can call me Huey. Huey Can. Really? I wish it was more of a punny name. I know Hugh is... Yes? Okay. And now he's going to pull a Navi thing. Was like, you can always press up to talk to me. You know you want to talk to me. Alrighty, can we, can we get a move on here, buddy? Buddy or pal? I don't know why. Um, throughout playing video games, I think the hardest thing for me to do is... Uh, play tutorials don't know why don't just don't know but the hardest thing for me to do is play tutorials because I'm I pick up on games rather quickly so if there's a tutorial going on it just it just bothers me 
And so another goal of the game is that you need to go around and uh, repaint everything. And repainting things eventually, I'm assuming, will unlock everything. Okay. Do 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 do. So, yep. And he's good. And they're talking about the uh, bridge builder, which we need to find, which you'll find on your adventures, which will be in every episode. I don't know how long this game is, by the way. I'm gonna try to keep the episodes shorter than like half an hour episodes. This episode might be a little bit long. Not quite sure. Uh, saving perfecto. Yes, it's a save block, Huey. Anybody, who's anybody knows it's a save block. Doo -doo. Yes, I, I'm Mr. Fix-It now. Can we continue on with our adventures? I know I can talk to you, Huey. Oh, there's a Goomba. Okay. Again, sorry, I can't show you this. However, I'm just going to do a quick little stomp a on his face, and it will be all right. Okay, I'm running low on ink. And I'm using the broken shoes just because uh, I can time these well. And sometimes the broken shoes won't do it all, if just for like one bounce. But if you get them multiple bounces, the broken shoes usually do it. Uh, and he was going to talk to me about this. This is um, a hammer upgrade. It's so when, uh, if you collect enough of them, you can, uh, uh, you get enough of them, your paint will increase more. And what I really like is that if you're, say, you use blue to get all these, you just hit everything again with a hammer. And you get m way more paint than you actually put into them. Oh, well, I'll get the blue one, I swear I will. There we go. Okay. And don't worry, they'll all pop back up. Are you the bridge builder? Good night, cruel world! Oh, you pessimist. Wait, well, you're not a Goomba. You're Mario. I can't believe that guy took me out. I lost to the first Goomba, just like the, just like a grandma. Well, thank you for replenishing me. This, this blue district and well, we used to use. Oh no, he's the um, card seller. I think. I don't know. Um. And I take offense to that. My grandma was great at Paper Mario. She was actually the one who introduced me to Paper Mario, and I remember uh, begging her to go over to her house just so I may play Paper Mario. I know, Huey. You're awesome. I'm sorry that I'm not talking to you. I just gotta replenish all of the toads. Okay. What the scrap? Okay. So now we just need to head on uh, this way so that we I'm not I'm not that stupid I'm gonna try to replenish all the toads but I know they have like dialogue that just drowns on forever okay oh nope dang it try always trying to get the the upper hand when you play these type of Mario games because you deal damage in the real world or in the outside world rather than in the game that way you don't you can save on cards perfect and I get a perfect bonus yes I do alrighty and pick up your droppings replenish this toad that's the one thing I hate about replenishing toads though is I never know what color they are and which they will use up different paints, like my blue and my yellow would took up to that one. Okay. Where far are we going? Uh, oh! See? Okay. Now that I whacked him with my hammer, now he's at half-life. Which, I will use another broken shoe because they work perfectly with these fellas. And we'll paint her up, and we'll flick ya. Flick ya. Come on, flick ya. I don't need done paint. It's all right. No, it's like it. There we go. All right, fight a Rooney. And one, and two, and a three, and boop. Gotcha. And I have to replenish that one toad back there. I'd be very, I'd be very ashamed if I accidentally went to go uh, fix a toad, and the toad inst 
Bye, Toad. And the Toad instead um, doesn't get refilled and it was the enemy that got refilled. Yeah. So now I'm up to 150. And I think he goes up by 30s. So I think I was at 120. Mario, I'm in here. Help me. I will help you. Um. Hi. Did you hear my squeaking, annoying voice? I totally crushed that toad impression. Wow, why do you gotta be so mean towards the toads, man? Dang. Oh, I didn't. Okay. I actually never opened that door. When playing when when playing this by myself, I I tend to skip over a lot of things, but I want to show off this game just because I love the series so much. Alrighty. Ding! You really are a hero. Uh, what? Another one? Nope, that's definitely a purple toad or a pink toad. I don't remember. Whoa, Tag, I take it easy. What were you expecting? My apologies for a rather uh, non existent welcome to Port Prisma. As you are. As you're no doubt aware, we've been dealing with an invasion of paint-stealing hooligans. Anyhow, if in, if gone as planned, this would have been your quest or your guest quarters. So that's where Toad. Yep. Yeah, okay. So that's where Toad and Peach are going to be staying. However, they weren't told that originally. So, I mean, okay. Princess Peach offers a ballad. I don't care. Okay, so apparently that's where I can rest. Good to know. Don't hesitate to come visit. Ro yep, restore your health. Awesome. So that's like a restore point. I wonder if there's more of those around. If there's more of those around. Then we're in good shape. Um, I saw this earlier. We gotta get that. Okay. And I see there's a shy guy in that one, that's why I don't want to open it. There's a shy guy right there sucking the water, though, so. Okay, so he stopped the water flow because he's sucking the paint. Oh my god, Huey. You're going on the list of annoying sidekicks. I should have used a... Hammer. I wonder if I have a hammer in here. Do I have a hammer? Oh, there's a hammer. I'll use this hammer. It's a uh, broken. No, I'm not done painting. I almost messed it up there. So it's a broken hammer, but it should work the same. Awesome. Okay, now I assume, I assume we're gonna repaint the water, and then okay, fine. Don't don't draw me anything. And this should. Get that wheel moving from back there. And again, I'm sorry if this is a long episode. I just needed to get this one done. The beginning is always long. I, I I cut out a lot from the very beginning. It was like the backstory, which I could tell you that's why I did it. But there's a lot going on in this first bit because they're trying to get you hooked on it. Which I can tell you, they just put Paper Mario in the title, title and I was hooked on it. Now, when it comes to Paper Mario games, I have to play them, uh, and then I get, or I get more hooked as more as I play them, because I was, uh, what was that, Super Paper Mario for the Wii? I was so excited, because I was like, yes, another Paper Mario game, oh, it's going to be so great, and then it was not at all. Uh, it kind of, it tried to keep the Paper Mario aspects, but uh, it just... It, it didn't do well at all. You you had to choose between who you wanted to be. I liked the 2D, 3D transition that they did. But I couldn't get behind the... Um, oh, what do you want to call it? Their... Uh, their battling system. It was... It wasn't turn-based, like, how they went back to. Um, and I think that was a good point. A good thing for them to go back to the turn-based. But before that, it just wasn't it was super mario with 
Paper Mario. And as interesting as it was, it wasn't Paper Mario. And if it's Paper Mario, at least keep it turn-based. No matter how you're going to style it, I still think you should go around and get the partners. Ooh. You should go around and get the partners and unlock the stars and save Mr. Krabs and get the crown and save Kenny Bottom, but yeah. And that will be the next area we go to. Alrighty. Well, guys, I'm going to leave this episode here, so I thank you so much for watching this one. And until then, I'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much again for watching this video. If you liked it, don't forget to tell me down in the comments or give me a thumbs up. Also, hit the channel icon to subscribe, and don't forget to hit the thumbnail for more videos.